is up guys, yeah, Holder here, welcome back to Fire Emblem Shadow Dragon. So last time we took on chapter 22, or no, chapter 21, we're taking on chapter 22 today. Chapter 22 where we fought Dr. Phil, <laughs> and we're moving on chapter 22. A night filled sky, the Macedonian, or the Macedon area. The good old McCullis map. I'm interested to see reinforcement changes here because this map you get just bombarded so oh, I also really like this illustration of him too the Macedon Minerva and Maria remembered best was once of peace or was one of peace a quiet prosperous kingdom famed for the flying beasts favored by Draconites but then their brother Prince Michalis succumbed to his lust for power despite his sister's adamant opposition he swore allegiance to Dolor, and when Macedon's dragoons took flight, the world suffered. Even now that the tides had turned, Macaulay's took position for one last stand. Draconites filled the sky end to end, eager to pluck Marth from the earth. That paints quite a picture, and I dig it. We can bring 16 people, so everyone we got. Emir is full of goodies. Unload all of it. Give you another axe back. Uh, yeah, we'll give you an iron bow. And give him, we'll give him a hand axe as well. And maybe killer axe? Sure. Why not? Uh, how's S doing? Okay. A little bit more, and hopefully we'll be good to go there. Uh, so this is the map where we also would be getting rid of our orbs, and I've decided against it. I want to beat the game having all three of the orbs still in my possession, mainly because I really, really dig them. <laughs> I've had a lot of fun with them in this game with, like, I honestly, I think it's, well, the addition of new weapons that weren't in the original, and being able to... Uh, forge your weapons. I am valuing the orbs way more because I can forge things. So we are not going to be turning the orbs in. I do kind of want to see the conversation though, so I'm probably going to save state in front of the village, turn them in just to see the dialogue, and then revert back uh, because the dialogue in this game so far has been pretty good. So I, I do want to see that. Uh, Julian, there's really no need. He's, he's, he's our Geosphere button. That's what he has become. Um, I guess we could also give that to Tiki, but Julian doesn't really fight, so he's our Geosphere button if we decide we want to hit it. I don't think there's anything else I really want to do. Our healing looks good. Where is Cord? Uh, uh Cord's healing doesn't look good. His offense also not looking amazing. Do we have the hammer on Lena right now? Yeah, I'm probably gonna repair the Excalibur on this map. Uh, healing. You know, take a mend. Get some healing upgrade in your life. And with this map, I think I am gonna break out the Parthia. Our silver bow's not looking good. But with all of this... We should be good. We have two extra longbows if I break one, so I'm good there. Our axes look fine. Marth, Mercurius, Worm Slayer, Silver Sword looking good. Yeah, I think we're we're good to go. So, let's view map real quick. Uh, well, it's sure packed in. That's for damn sure. Anything like real terrifying? There's Rider's Bane to worry about. Now there's Rider's Bane to worry about. Of course, the Bow Knights are always problematic. Uh, of course, Iode Shield, or Iode Shield, Iote Shield, however you want to say it. I'm not really sure the correct way to say it. Good old Stern Face Macalus. Uh, fortifies. Silver Lances. Killer Lance. Okay. Uh, ooh, what do we have here? Let's see. So, Armory 1, Iron Bow, Steel Bow, Killer Bow. Ooh, I can buy siege weapons for our ballistician, for Jake. I 
might have to do that. They're fairly cheap, too. Especially if I have them with the silver card. Uh, Armory 2, I can buy another Wing Spear. I might do that. Uh, and then the healing shops, we have Heal Mint, Recover, and Vulnerary, and Fire, Thunder, Blizzard, and Hellfire. Okay. So, maybe stock up, restock up on some Ballistician weapons and buy the Wing Spear. How much money do I even have? I know I just spent a bunch of it on, we have 12k left. That should be, we'll probably spend all of that. Uh, I know we, we spent a lot of it on, um, Stat boosters, which, speaking of, okay, these energy drops, Est, can I, let's see, store that real quick. She needs, at the very minimum, one. At the very minimum, she needs one. Retrieve that, or a vulnerary back. Uh, and your weapons, looking good, 14 strength. Hopefully we can get maybe 17 before 20. Where is, I know Marth, 10 defense. I would like to give him, I know, store the light sphere, retrieve. Draco shield, let's use at least one. I'm gonna hold on to the other one for now. That stone back. Light sphere. Okay. Uh, where's our girl? Where's Maria? There she is. She could probably use another. You know what? I will. I'm gonna do that right here, right now. Put away the javelin. Energy drop. And I'm gonna save the last one. So 14 strength for you. She also can wield the Gradivus. So that's big help. What did I get rid of? Javelin. Like that. Uh, and the only other thing, I, person I could think of, speed. Why did I buy a bunch of speed? I feel like there was a specific person. Kane could really use that. She'd have capped her speed. Um, Marth is looking pretty good on speed. Same as Maria. Bored could probably use speed. Um... Board and Kane are the main ones I see that could really benefit from, from, from some speed wings. But I'll hold off. I'll hold off for a bit. Let me save. And let's get it going. Lord Goto, the League has begun its attack. I wish for you to move someplace safe until the fighting has ended. Why not just end this folly right now, McCullus? Folly? What folly? You loved your younger sister so much, it pains me to see you had to, uh, to see you quarrel. If you and Minerva had worked as one, Mastodon might have become a great kingdom. Greater even than Arcania, perhaps. But instead, you let Garnef trick you into destroying your family, and your kingdom with it. I cannot undo what's done. My father's blood will always be on my hands, just as Minerva's betrayal of her brother and country will be on hers. And Mastodon has not yet been destroyed. Or has not been destroyed. Not yet. So long as I carry Iode's shield. League's arrows cannot fill me. Very well, and if you win, what then? If I win, I will tell you. Right now, my only goal is to gut that Altaian prince who leads the League. My pride as a Macedonian king rests upon it. I see, and we've nothing more to discuss, have we? The weight of his father's murder threatens to crush him. Poor boy. Poor fool. Okay. And actually... You're way over here. Oh, you don't even have a warp on you. I was thinking I could just like, you know, because I'm gonna save state anyway, I could warp up there, but Mars all the way over here. I need to move people around. Eh. Eh. All right, what do we got in this house? Julian, go visit it. A great sage lives in the north, to the uh, village to the north. He's not very sociable though. Hardly anyone ever sees him. So let's see. Uh, the wall. Oh, reinforcements. That's what I wanted to check. They start from turn seven and they go till turn fourteen. I think that's a little 
more lenient? I'm not sure. But I know it's all in here. So turn seven. That might not be really any different. Uh, but okay. I'm gonna take Mart. Well, because I don't really care about. Well, I. Is there a thief on this map? I was like, the thing I'm worried about is I want to see the dialogue. Like, I don't care about the, you know, starlight that you get from it. So, you know what? Let's do that real quick. Okay. So, I have both in Marth's inventory, the star and light sphere. The earth sphere, we get to keep regardless. But, let's check out this dialogue. You have the light sphere and star sphere with you? Well done. Now I can create starlight for you. There, it is finished. Take this with you. It's the only magic capable of breaking through Imhulu. Use it to stop that fiend Garneth once and for all. Oh, that was, there was not much to that whatsoever. Huh. Okay. I thought there'd be a little, a little bit more going on. But we do have starlight. I do want to look at it. I like the fancy blue book. 13 might. Four weight. Okay. Cool. Well, that's that. Now we don't have to worry about it. Okay, so where is... Let's see, there's Sheeta. We're gonna imitate her for the wing spear. And our main walls... I mean, well, Sedgar. We'll take Sedgar over here. Horus over here. Now, Jake is probably gonna be pretty beneficial. It's aerospace. Oh, yes. Oh, very much so. But I also very much want the fortifies down. Uh, the other one's probably going to fortify and undo the damage I just did. But that's fine. Um, let's take Cord over here. Sheeta and Athena. Everyone else is going to go left. I've done this like two different ways. Like one where I just have everyone huddle up on the right side. And then this way where I split in half and meet at the center. There is a thief in there. And then yeah, everyone just kind of clustering. Uh, if I use the pachyderm, perfect. All right, Jake with a level. So perfect. All right. I don't want to get too ahead of myself. Get too antsy about uh, coming out here. So I get swarmed. Won't be good. It definitely won't be good. Zane. Uh, I mean, if Sheeta's going left, we'll take Zane this way, so we have a Sheeta for both sides. Uh, and that way, we can turn into Maria or someone else whenever it runs out. Okay, what do we have coming this way? Have Silver Lance. How much speed? 17 speed, 27 attack. Okay. How much defense? 13. Maria. Over here. How far do you reach? Oh, perfect. Okay, heal up. Zane, just so he has the full Sheeta HP. Tiki over here. Pachyderm. All right, so Killer Lance, Javelin, Javelin. And these guys have a lot more movement. 
two more movement. So, back away just a bit. Okay, don't be too reckless here. trying to, to end it, but I keep accidentally targeting something. Dodging 68. Nice Gradivus hit. Javelin doing zero damage. Do a nice chunk in return. Of course, not able to double. Fortify. Being annoying. But, here, Pachyderm. I didn't actually need the full Pachyderm to do that. But, that's done. So no more Fortifies. Uh, you are the next person I have to worry about. So, Wing Spear. Hmm, I want to do this. We have enough speed and just HP. Athena can face tank. And it's an armor slayer. Yeah, we can we can face tank that. H Sedgar can face tank an armor slayer. Horus, not so much, but Sedgar absolutely can. Um, twenty-eight. Okay. Let's do that on this guy. And then. Oh yeah, Excalibur against Flyers. Forgot about that. And I also forgot to hammer it in. Let's see, Est. Well, no, I need to do a little bit more before I attack with Est. And leave. It's just, it's just you. Well, he crit. So much for giving it to Est. And he got strength, all right. I don't know, there's a lot of shit in here. So to try and warp, warp skip Michaelis, mm, mm. There might be a, a strat if you're using like both Ballisticians, like maybe Pachyderm and then trade over another Pachyderm. I don't know how much damage we do to him. I don't think I've checked. But there might be a strat where you could double Pachyderm. Maybe. Maybe, maybe double Pachyderm, double warp. That way you warp like, uh, warp your Excalibur over here, or some other really good mage, and then warp Marth. Just be done with it. But then I guess it also depends if you want the the Starlight Fear run. So let's see. This is normal fire. Normal fire doesn't kill. Excalibur is just a one, one and done. Might as well. Cheetah, Iron Lance. <sighs> Alright, Javelin 84, thank you. Look one HP away from killing with an Iron Lance. With a blank level, oh boy. <sighs> Gotta love it. Gotta love it. Kill with Athena. And there's a sword incoming, so I'm not even gonna bother putting Ymir in there. Armor Slayer, yeah, he does six whole damage with an Armor Slayer. Look at you. Big damage out here. Okay, Javelin, Silver Lance, and we have a Silver Bow. Now, no Iote Sphere, or Iote Shield for Maria. We have 17 speed. Okay, Kane is gonna be doubled. <laughs> so, I think... Yeah, with everyone else being this far behind, I don't really want to pull it in. So I will wait another turn outside its range. And then deal with it. It comes 
then... This are over here. I let you Riders Bane. Uh, we have no Riders over here. Do a little bit with fire. And then Emir. Hand Axe. If it hit. Okay, so what was it? Riders Bane. Longbow to stay out of the wyvern's range, though it doesn't really matter a whole lot. And actually, cord. Well, okay, cord. Six defense. Uh, if you want to walk up and hit cord, be my guest. Not Emir, though. <laughs> Not Emir. Cord has enough speed, it doesn't matter. He probably won't enjoy the hit. Wait, I have fire equipped, right? Not Excalibur. Yes. Oh, let's see. Pachyderm on Macaulay's does a nine. Okay, so it seems like double warp strat would be better here. Warp up a mage. Uh, is there anything? I mean, might as well start damaging some of these. There's an arrow here, right? Yeah, arrow spate. Goodbye, Goto. He does come in to attack for it. Does a lot of damage, but he can't double me. So that's what really matters. I knew we wouldn't like the damage, but it's still safe. Okay, arrow on you. Just start hitting all of them. HP, strength, skill, and luck. Okay. So. I don't know how much you actually matter. What turn is it? Six. Okay, reinforcements are going to start fairly soon. Only have a bow. Wow. How much speed? I need 17 speed. Wow. Okay. Oh, and Zane, of course. Of course, Zane. Hmm. I don't want to do this. Well, Rider's Bane one-shots this guy. He's the one I'm most afraid of. Zane changing back now of all times. It's like the worst possible thing. Uh, that kills. That sure kills. Uh, what is our devil percent right now? What, 12? 13%? Isn't it 31? 31. Minus your luck. In hindsight, maybe poleaxing this dude would have been better. I think, I mean, I think you can still manage, like. Get him a level. I was like, let's deal with this side first. More speed. All right. I was like, oh shit, what is that? <laughs> a thief. <sighs> How much damage do we do with other weapons? We do 20. That's a silver lance, so that guy, that guy just needs to go. He just needs to go. And doing so in a, in a good way doesn't seem like I can gradivus him. I could have traded the Rider's Bane, now that I see. I could have sat here, traded over the Rider's Bane, probably one shot. Um, well, maybe not. Minus four strength, I don't know. I don't know, I could calculate out the C, but what's done is done. Est can kill that guy. Man, 
Zane untransforming. Right there of all places. 15 damage. Shit going on here. Seven weight. Why are we not doubling, man? We have some speed, so it comes down to weapon weight. Mercurius, 20. We take nine damage if we get hit. 17% crit. I'm gonna go for it. No crit. And of course, of course, we do get hit. Um. Alright. We just have to land it. Which we do. Okay, thank you, Est. Strength? Nope. Defense? I mean, okay. Uh, let's imitate Kane, I guess. Hello. No. 15 defense. Your speed. Uh, you should be good. You should be good. I can also... If I am worried, I can Physic. Which I kinda am worried. I'll Physic him up. So that could have been way more optimized. I just kinda panicked, cause Zane was no longer Sheeta. Couldn't use the Wing Spear. Uh, and he is attacking Ast, who can't attack back, thank god. No fear of her taking damage and then killing herself on the Devil Sword. Him, but all these guys are moving now. Oh boy. Okay. I don't know why I went for that. I just decided, yep. <laughs> this is the play to make. Silver bow, I need damage. Finish the job with Sheeta. All right. And run up with Sedgar. Rider's Bane. Okay. Maria kills with the Gradivus. Silver Sword, Rider's Bane, and a Javelin coming in. Poleaxe. Back away there, get Horus in here. The Steel Lance. Over here with Kane. Looks like they all went this way. As me. Pretty scared. Not gonna lie. You're curious. All right, one on board. Okay, so if they attack board, like we're good. I was worried about Maria getting triple teamed. Oh, but he does get doubled, so it's good. I mean, you know, 49 hit me in the first place. That's, that's shitty. Oh, fuck, hello. <laughs> oh, I was like, Silver Sword does, does hurt. That hurts a lot. Uh, you are fast. If I land that, but if I don't, I, there's a good chance I die. Okay, what about Tiki? Tiki finally gets in range of something. Yeah, you know what, Tiki, go. Smash. Destroy. There we go. And then Maria, not Maria, Est. Javelin this guy. Do a little bit there. Gradivus there. Just slowly chipping him away. Uh, let's go with a killer axe. No crits. He 
from a one HP and 90 H or 90 experience for Athena. So we might as well steel bow. What kind of level we got, Athena? Hell yeah, strength and speed. Throw in that HP. Okay, didn't say from turn seven. It's turn eight. All right. Can't complain too much, I guess. Over here, arrow. One shot that guy. Could Rider's Bane this guy down, but also, no, that's a Javelin. I killed the Rider's Bane. Okay, Iron Axe, finish you. We have 10 HP, okay, I was like, how much HP you got? Geosphere's 13. <laughs> it's a possibility. 16 here, no crits, thank you. So S to walk up, Steel Sword. Finish the job. I didn't give very much. Um, oh shit, wait, 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 wait. What is it? Oh, just a javelin? Okay, we're good. I was like, wait, wait a minute, there's still red. Who's here? But we're all good. All good. Uh, but while we're here, Convoy, store, the worm slayer, retrieve the silver card. Okay, so I'll buy at the very least one of each. But the amount of Th that's that's all I should need. I'll buy a killer bow too. Why not? That's all I should need. There's not that many maps left in the game. Hello. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Same turn reinforcements. Uh-oh. They said turn seven. It was turn eight. I know what's happening. Well, all right. Of course. I finally get over here, buy things, think I'm safe. Spawn from what here? I would be able to get all the way and attack, like here anyway. But like, fuck. I'm kinda debating that, well, I can't really do double warp strat, can't well no, I think I might be able to. I'm kinda debating doing that now. Because I really don't want to do anything. <laughs> but I do want to buy... <sighs> the struggle. The struggle of wanting to buy... Well, okay. Let's look at Jake's weapons. So Jake, out of the three things, it's an arrow, a stone, and a flame. It's arrow 16. And we've been using it, right? Uh, flame? It's at 12. That's fine. Stone? Stone would be useful. But I could just hammer it. The wing spear. We have the the one over here, wherever Zane is. Is this Zane? We have a 24 out of 28 use wing spear here. This one's 13 out of 28. And do we have one in the convoy? Or is the one in the convoy that I'm thinking of? Zane's inventory. Nope, and we have another one in the... Okay, you know what? We're doing it. We're doing it. The experience would be fantastic. But... Your boy's impatient. <laughs> okay. So, how we're gonna do this is we're gonna start with the Geosphere. Do 13 damage to him. Well, to everyone. But... Mainly get a nice 13 on Macalus. Um... Oh, looking at how many people are surrounding him? Hmm. <laughs> okay. It'd be a one turn. Isn't exactly... I'm gonna 
happen. Two turn, I guess, will be uh, the play. Pachyderm. See the problem, right? Well, no, I say that. It could still be one turn, because I, I put the person who needs to kill him here. Or here. Uh, and then I warp Marth directly onto the throne and be done with it. So let's try this. Um, my ideas were Athena or Tiki. The light sphere does what again? nullifies the effects of terrain. Okay. I want that in someone else's inventory. <laughs> okay. So, there's that. And then... I might actually be able to triple warp if I use Zane. Well, it wouldn't be a one turn. It would have to be a two turn if I use Zane. Okay. So... Warp Athena. Right here. Now, I haven't actually looked at any of the numbers. This is just all guesses. Yeah. Yeah. Made it this far, have you? Don't gloat yet. My dragons and I still rule these skies. I mean, that's cool. But. Finish. Forgive me, my people. He has a good-ass battle theme, though. HP, skill, speed. So we don't get the strength level this time. But, that's fine. Leave it to the reinforcements to kill Maria. Could have taken all that experience. We didn't get strength on Est anyway, so like really, what did we lose? A blank level on Cheetah, that's what we lost. First General Camus of Gross, now Prince Macalus of Macedon. Oh wait, that's not Maladus speaking. Uh, such of men, uh, men of such promise. The time's been different, the two might have led illustrious lives. Yes, Prince Macalus was a brilliant man with a great thing, uh, with great things ahead of him. But in the end, the rashness of youth did him in. Because Ghana found his weakness and exploited it. Until we stop that fiend, the spiral of misery will never cease. Wait, I feel like that was Marth again. Whatever. Then shall we go to Thames? Lord Goto said the city lies uh, someplace far to the north of the deep. Yes, in the heart of the desert. Thames is an old city. None in recent memory have gone there and returned alive. Within its walls remain many powerful apparatus crafted by long of long forgotten magic. Lord Goto believes God of his harnessing their power, and that is why he wields such influence with the continent. And he has Imhulu as well. This will be a struggle. Still, Garnet's reign must end. The world was so much more beautiful before he painted it red. Well. Oh, I was supposed to you know what? We have that. Let's see here. Uh, what? I was like, I need to get back to the menu. So we get to have a look-see here. Suspend. Continue on this save. Where is our girl? Is it you? Yes. I really wanted to see this dialogue, and I did get a comment about it, and I completely forgot about it until just now. So, M Maria, what are you doing here? Oh, is that, is that it? Is that really it? Oh, I thought there was gonna be something substantial about it, but that's that's it. Whatever. All right. <laughs> Well, chapter down, experience gone, whatever. I, I don't care at this point. <laughs> we have stab boosters and it's it's fine. It's fine. We have plenty of warps left to do that for other maps if we need to. Um, but that's gonna be it. So thank you all for watching. 
Uh, hopefully you enjoyed, and I will see you all next time. Bye.